Hey guys, it's Vandy Ezzel, back in with another Pokemon Sun and Moon videos. If you guys enjoy, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and join to the Patreon. And let's get this one started. So in the last one, we had a face-off with Guzma, the head of Team Skull. And this time we're going to head to Route... I want to say it's 13. I am 95% sure I'm wrong on that fact. It's the route here on this little... I forgot I could do this. It's the right here on this little side port, and what it's going to do is it's going to lead us to our next island trial. So that's pretty much what we're going to do. So if you guys enjoyed, and don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and I probably said, oh, I was so close. And the worst part is I, like, pulled the number 13 out of my ass. Oh, I have to heal Robin. Oh, yeah. Ah, nah, Robin will be fine. I think Robin can handle it. Uh, do you heal by any chance? Young boy, I... Oh, she does. Nani? Um, okay then, I didn't think she would heal me, but sure. Um, here's a double battle, actually, and you know what? We haven't seen Pecky in a while, and not to spoil anything, but, um, we have one more team member to get, and all I'm gonna say is this, there is a certain team member I'm sacrificing for that thing, and it may or may not be Pecky, because... I'm trying to use Pokemon I never used before, or that I rarely use, and Pecky, considering it's the early bird Pokemon, means I use it a lot. Oh my god, a Hurtier! Oh, I remember Pokemon Black and White. I remember um, my Lily Pup. I don't, I never had a nickname for it. But I remember Stoutland. Oh my god, it was so perfect. Okay, anyways, there was a glitch in the camera, but it's fine, because um, Shadow Arrow Raid is a move that I love using so much. Just because I love arrows, I love birdies, especially to some extent, like, just, um, owls, I guess. And hell yeah, it one-shot it. Where did Toad Cannon go? Oh, there it is. It just disappeared off the map at some point. Um, so yeah. Oh, God, the crunch. My, uh, talking is not going to be that great this episode because I'm still trying to get into it. Oh, I really thought it would one-shot it. Well, we'll just go pluck with double pluck action, baby. Pluck the hardier down to size. But yeah. So this is going to be the grind episode. Hopefully my camera doesn't glitch again. Which I have the feeling that it will. Squirt is level 19. And so if it doesn't glitch, that will be perfect for me. I don't know where to get the lucky egg at. I wish I had a lucky egg. Because that would mean I could evolve Squirt. Or not evolve Squirt. Because I don't think Eevee has an evolution in this game. Unless I have played this game for years. And watched one playthrough of it and then never saw it, seen the evolution of it or ever heard anyone talk about it. Especially considering how much I love evolution, so people would have told me about it by now. But, um, yeah, so I doubt a Squirt has an evolution. So we almost have the full team. Who, I don't know if the uh, conversation got cut off, but before the camera decided if it was going to glitch or not, I was just talking about how, uh, okay, that guy was talking about Kalos. I was talking about how um, we have one more team member left that I will probably replacing Tucano for. And the sad part about it is Tucano would get replaced at like the end of the game in terms of like story-wise because it, the thing I'm thinking of, who it comes in very late in the game. A lot of you probably know what it is. To those of you that don't, I am honestly surprised that you don't know what it is considering it would I feel like it's kind of obvious, like it's something that a lot of people were, were looking forward to in Sun and Moon, at least to my knowledge, a lot of people were looking forward to it in Sun and Moon, and a lot of people signed up to um, get it really early, so I feel like, you know, it's something that a lot of people know about, but, you know, maybe they don't, and I'm just kind of just ranting on as I battle through all of these bleeding trainers, because this is j just grinding, honestly, because the next island trial is a ghost trial and just ghost is super effective against ghost so i could just ram through with decidueye and pray or robin and pray that they don't um oh he's is robin am i under leveled for being able to train robin because he keeps doing that <laughs> is that good bad oh god they sent out squirt um there is a Pokemon Center, I mean, like, right back there. Wait, what? Whoa, wait, Squirt outsped this thing? How fast is Vaporeon at level 
19! What? How fast is this thing? There's no reason in the hell this should have outsped a Hariyama that's a level- Okay, don't kill it. Huh. As glad as I am I didn't switch it, another Pokemon in, what just happened? I don't think Squirt had... Squirt had 32 speed. I highly doubt that a level 28 Hariyama doesn't have at least 32 speed. I refuse to believe for a second that it doesn't. I mean, it probably... It might not, because I, I consider Hariyama like a heavy Pokemon, so I could see why it wouldn't... Why it would be um heavier, but still... Anyways, on to our next moment. I saw... Okay, there's a Zygra cube. Greetings, trial goer. Let me check your collection of Z-Crystals. Huh. Look at the blinding yellow Electrium Z. Now I guess I'll have to open the gate for you. What you face up ahead is the ghost-type trial. I hope you enjoy it. I didn't know she said it. I wouldn't have said anything if I knew that she was going to say it for me. Okay. Anyways... Oh, I, you know, at the end of this episode, I'll go do it. I'll, I, I know they have one nearby. I'll go do it at the end of this episode when I actually remember to. Hopefully I remember to. If I don't, then that's just classic me. Greetings, Ezul. Oh, hi, um, Hapu. I don't know what I was about to call how. Well, me, well, meet. I was seeking you. If you're going to travel about Ulu Ula, Ula, you ought to do it while astride a Mudsdale. There is no call for hesitation. Consider it my thanks for Akalei Island. So, yeah, if you don't remember, we just helped her, like, conquer Team Skull, I guess. Or beat Team Skull. It was remiss of me not to register her for you when we met one another in Malale. I was just so taken ba aback by Lily and how lovely she was that escaped me. But by no means was I waiting for a time when you were in trouble. I don't think we're in trouble now, but I guess we could use this Musdale. If you seek the next trowel, so go straight to here to Tapu Village. I'll be cheering you on for your island trial. Thanks. She seems really nice. All these people seem really nice. They, they all of them are just not assholes. I, I don't know why I claim gym leaders to be kind of assholes, but when I think of gym leaders compared to island trial, I think the gym leaders are more assholes than um helpful people. Well, let's use this Musdale. It allows us to travel on these, because if you couldn't see it before, we were not able to travel across them. And now we are. And I didn't pay attention. We got a burn heal. Okay, we got more Zygrade cubes. So I have access to the dog. What's the next form? Is it just regular Zygrade and then it goes perfect form? Which I've literally never used in battle before, yet seen in battle before. Wait, there's a Pokemon here. There's a Pokemon here I really want to get. But the problem is, there's already a Pokemon on, on our team with the same type as that thing. So, even if I catch it, I can't use it on the main team. Okay, good, it wasn't there, so I don't have to feel that bad. Uh, I'm pretty sure it's here. I, I'm pretty sure the thing I'm thinking of is here. But I cannot get it, because I already have someone of the same type on my team, and I don't want to repeat types unless necessary. Like... All, okay, all I'm going to say is this and I'll leave it to rest for now unless I can think about other reasons later. The Pokemon I'm planning on replacing for Tucano, already on our final team, I was going to tell you who's on our final team right now guaranteed, is Luna the Growlithe, Finn the Lycanroc, Robin the Decidueye, Pecky, I mean not Pecky, Pecky's off the team, Striver the Raichu, and Squirt the Vaporeon. There's one more member and out of all of those five, he shares a type with one of them. That is all I'm going to say. He shares a type with one of them. If you know who it is, okay then. Well, I could just choose not to do this, but I want experience, especially because I want to make Squirt kind of overleveled. Not overleveled, but what I need is I need Squirt to kind of catch up in levels. The weather in the lull is too nice, so you go get I, yeah, so you get why I want to get rowdy. A weak trainer blames losses on his or her Pokemon. Um. I thought of the film, that's exactly what he's gonna do. Either way, I just like how the Team Skull Grunts... Oh, they're punks, not Team Skull Grunts. I was about to say, I was. I like how they're Team Skull Grunts, but like not involved in the story, and then they proved me wrong. Oh my god, it's Crocodile! 
Another Pokemon on my final team from Pokemon Black and White who did absolutely nothing in the face of Haxorus, the destroyer of the Elite Four. Quite literally, Haxorus just rammed through the entirety of the Elite Four, and I will always remember that as the, just the funniest thing ever, how I accidentally overleveled it, and it just swept the entirety of it, which was just beautiful. So, yeah. Anyways, okay, cool. Robin gets some levels up. I need Vaporeon to get levels, though, because while the island... While there is no island travel anymore... I mean, there is an island challenge... I mean, not island challenge. There is a Kahuna battle where it'll be useful in... But I wanted to get leveled up with the rest of the team because it's on the final team. Like, if um, Pecky stopped leveling up now, I honestly would not give two shits. Like, if Pecky starts falling behind, I don't care. No offense, Pecky. But the second I get the chance, I am replacing Pecky. Because, like I said, that one Pokemon, I really want to use it. And I never use it. Or, like, I'll catch it, but I'll never use it on my final team because, hey, like, the game's already over. So, I will get it and train it. And then, um, you know, hopefully I get to just take advantage of it fully. How long have we been recording for? Nine minutes. I mean, ten minutes now, so. Okay, okay. Uh, Rising Star Matthew. He has a crane dose. Another one of my favorite Pokemon. This is just the area of me running into some of my favorites. Like, we have Craney Dose over here, which was like my first favorite rock type. We had Panchan, one of my favorite fighting types. We had Crocodile over there, literally a part of my main team in black and white. Um, all we're missing is a Haxorus. Like, quite, if, if we see a Haxorus, I'm, I'm just going to end the episode if we see a Haxorus out of randomness. Speaking of which, can I forgot. Did we have the ability to catch an Axew in this game? Because I know you could. I know we would have caught one if we were talking about X and Y. We would have already seen one in, in terms of like gym trial wise, and then probably would have tried catching it already. Um, this leads to a side quest. I will do off that. I will do that off screen, or I might not do it off screen, but I'm not going to do it here because I want to end the episode off. Here is oh oh my god! There was around thirteen in this. What? I put that on my ass earlier. How was I right? Ezel. I heard the news from Sophocles. You helped him out with the testing to Keen. Yeah, that totem calling machine or whatever. I guess that was the test subject number two, but I managed to get through the trial. Maybe even managed to get a bit stronger, eh? Here, Ezel, I want you to take this. May, come on. We don't need that right now. You only have one volume, don't you? Haven't you ever heard of the expression that sounds as golden? No one cares, edgy teen boy of 1995. God, he's back! Listen, Team Skull is looking for a Pokemon called Cosmog. Do you know anything of it? What? No, th not that we tell you. How? Why would you respond that way? Just say, what is a Cosmog? Damn it, cow! So you do know something. Look. Cosmog isn't even a strong Pokemon, but it has the potential to summon Pokemon so terrifyingly strong that you don't even know. It's something like a, that happened. It would be a disaster for Alola. A disaster? Like, a real disaster? Then what are we supposed to do about it? Protect it. If you do know where Cosmog is, or if you find anything about it, just keep it safe. I know it might be work. I know I might be working for Team Skull right now, so you may not trust me or care, but I'm going to tell you j this just this once. You have to protect Cosmog, no matter what. Um, hey, yeah, mate, no, 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 we need the edgy bad boy moment, come back. I still don't understand even how Team Skull found out Cosmog in the first place. What do you mean, no matter what? You're just gonna leave us hanging? Yeah, dude, um, it would, you know, don't leave us in the dark, guy. We kind of need some help. I got Hal over here, he's not that competent. Ezel, if they're really looking for Cosmog, then is Lily gonna be okay? I don't know, maybe we should go help her! <laughs> you know, we have Robin over here. I mean, we did a wreck through Guzma, but I don't wanna take my chances. I don't really get what's going on, but we've gotta just keep both of them safe, right? Then I know what I'm gonna do. Take on my next island trial so I can get even stronger. I'm gonna complete my island trial, and I'm gonna get Tapa Coco to recognize my strength. Then I'm gonna be the next island kahuna of which island, mate? I want to make sure more and more people can have fun battling to see who wins or loses. As well, let's both try to become real champions. Okay, well, I do agree with Hal on that front. Like, which island, actually? Because there are 
four different islands. If we count um, the Aether Paradise, I believe there's five different islands. So, yeah. Okay, I'm not going to bother reading the rest of this dialogue because none, none of this place, like, highly interested me and the last time i walked into a place randomly i accidentally ran into a side quest that i still get to do because i want to save it for the post game just in case i might be a bit under leveled all i'm going to say about this area is this one thing if you go here at the post game you will find one of the topos i am pretty sure one of them is lying there i might be wrong but i'm pretty sure i'm in the right here okay so we have some zygrid cubes dude these zygrid cubes are effing everywhere why? Oh, oh, ho, ho, ho. We got a Moonstone. I think a Pokemon I know evolves by Moonstone. I think we have one in the PC. I might go evolve it by Moonstone. I might not. I also might do a cheeky thing at the end of this episode just to see something. Because, um, speak of the devil, we're in Tapu Village. And it started raining immediately. Well... Interesting, and the story has advanced again without my permission. <laughs> Whoo! Look, Ezel. Seems like we're almost about. Seems like we're almost to the Aether House, where the captain's supposed to be, huh? Hey, look, construction workers. That must be what Kuki was talking about. So they're really making a Pokemon League up on top of Mount Lalakila. Manakila. The professor told me that Pokemon Leagues are in other countries have four crazy strong trainers in them that they call the Elite Four. Elite Four and, uh, and our island kahunas. I wonder which ones are stronger. I can't wait to find out. Well, that is something we will find out in a later part. Because obviously we're not going to take them on next episode. And we definitely ain't taking them on today. But before I end this episode, there is one thing I want to do back in Aka, I mean, Kokohone La Village. There's just one small thing that I cannot let go because I've been procrastinating on doing this for so long now and I'm at least going to do it while I remember it because I know I'm going to forget to do it later. If we go here, I believe, it is not this place. Ah. Um. Is it here? No, 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 where is it? Is it not on Akale? Is it not here on Akale? What? Um, huh. Well. Clearly, I'm stupid, because I thought I had something. No! Wait. I didn't enter the Pokemon. I... I'm a fucking idiot. Well, I'm gonna end it here. In the next one, you will see me in, um, the Tapu Village, because I was there, and I didn't realize that I had to go into the Pokemon Center to, you know, register the fly spot. So I'm gonna end it here. In the next one, we will continue with our journey. Hope you guys enjoyed. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, donate to the Patreon, Join the Discord, follow the Twitch, and I'll see you all in the next one. Don't forget that to check us out.